Hey guys, welcome back to some more Hand of Fates. I am Dirk, and today, back so soon. Today we beat you you the King Skull. Let us see what fate lies ahead now. Um, I want to do something real quick. Let's do. Let's turn it down just a tiny bit. Um, there we go. So we got story mode yet. King of Skulls. We're almost three quarters of the way through. Has the challenge become too much for you to face? But, uh, like I said, today, today we beat the King of Skulls. I'm tired of defeat. I require victory. Do you understand what it is we do now? Or did I rush five. you through the rules? Pushing you into the plate uh, before Let's give you food to the priest. Bad. Let's give him ten food. Um, hopefully he will give us something. A choice. Select your Success. desire. So we get one blessing gain and we get the token. I'm sure you are grateful. Will for the that. gods. Um, it highlights an enemy at the start, and if we kill the enemy first, we get five gold from it. And we got a token. Um, I wonder if it'll be charity six or if it'll move on to something else. Crap, we have the hangman. Another curse. You're not having much luck right now, are you? We have one blessing card, retribution. Whenever the player is struck by a ranged attack, there's a chance that the attacker will be stunned for three seconds. And we get a curse card, cowardice. The player cannot choose Little a combat encounter choice if there are any other choices. Away from bad luck. So basically, if we have a choice between combat and fleeing, we have to flee, I think. Um, but yeah, so let's continue on. Let's go left. Uh, another hanged man. Crap. We have Lizard Eater. Receive one food for Many every lizard these killed. Blessings are too good for the likes of and you. Tainted. We cannot sell anything. We're down to 80 max health. Um, there's the river. We'll... Avoid the river for now. Descend ever deeper into the subterranean pit. Let's go left first again. Cursed treasure. Let us stake a token on their foolishness. In the court of a remote rundown temple, you find a pile of treasure. You're welcome to the treasure, says a wizened old monk. But know that it is cursed. Um, last time we decided to leave the treasure. This time, let's take it. Um, as your fingers touch the first gold piece, you feel a chilled touch on your soul and your heart sinks. We have three additional curse cards on us now. Arcane Frailty, you take the extra damage from range attacks. The harder things become. Twice the fail, we lose five gold for every fail and ten gold for every huge failure. And Splintered Jewels on every Black successful deck combat without gauntlets, the player again. loses ring. So we've got a ton of curse cards on us now. We're down to 50 health. Oh boy. We get four gold gain cards though. 25 gold. 30 gold. 7 gold. And 30 more gold. And we get three equipment cards. Holy crap. Spirit walk. During combat, press right bumper to become ethereal, avoiding all damage until your next attack. Alright, Undead Bane. Does fire damage on hits against undead. Um, left bumper ignites all undead enemies. Um, yeah, we'll use that. As pleases you. And we have desperate measures. This makes it flex more damage the lower the health of the wielder is. Uh, we'll use that as well. Um, that'll be good since we have low health to start with. Um, so we have traveling mage. We're gonna have to buy some food. Without a doubt, we're gonna have to buy some food. Hopefully there will be something good here. Um, buy items. We've got hags wraps. Each strike inflicts a curse, slowing and weakening your opponent. Um, let's stick with what we've got so far. Let's just buy a ton of food. We'll get up to 20 and then call it good. I'm sure you are grateful for that. have like what 14 gold left yep okay 
So we'll call it good there. We'll leave the shop. Oops, I didn't mean to do that one. Angry Guildmaster. Everything is light or darkness, and our prince struggles. Oh crap. The I went too fast with the A button. Let's get past it. The hanged man. Yet again. One blessing, one curse. We get Headman's blessing. Any kill made the using an axe. Upon you Grants three health. Um, surprise attack. The first More hit in every combat inflicts triple I am damage. Proud of my array of Holy crap. Cave mouth. We're gonna end up dying before we even make it to a, 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 a combat encounter. Think about the way we play this game. Blood auction. You continue Let's leave. to die, yet we reset the board each time. One has to wonder how it is possible to truly lose. So we have the metal ore. Let's kind of take a look. Um, we'll take it. We have the traveling tinker. Um, let's approach. Maybe we can get a little extra food here. Won't be able to buy much, but um, we should be able to get, I'm guessing, three. Yep, three food. Alright, let's continue on then. We have the Holy Forge, and we have the Metal Ore this time. I will time. happily wager on the outcome. I do not think you have what it takes. On a dusty, lonely plain, you come across the shattered remains of an old monastery. Searching the building, you meet an old man dressed in dirty robes. Long ago, we of the Brotherhood forged holy weapons to support the war against the infidels, but the infidels were strong, and one day, one of the raiding parties took us by surprise. They destroyed most of our tools and took our supplies, including all of the rare, rare metal ore that we used to craft our weapons. The King's army never returned after that day. I know not what became of them in the years that followed. I have stayed here all these years, but only the ghosts remain to keep me company. All of the others who survived the attack left long ago. Let's give them the sampler of our ore. Uh, the monk's eyes widen in surprise, and he exclaims, By the old gods, where did you find that? He looks the metal over carefully. If you're willing to put in the hard work, stranger, together we could fire up the old forge one last time. You spend several days with the old monk. By day, you toil together at the forge, and by night, you swap tales of your adventures for a share of his food. Eventually, you hold the completed weapon in your hands. We have the battle hammer. Uh, string together consecutive attacks to do massive damage. Press left bumper to unleash a powerful explosion. So it does 40 damage and it has the holy effect. Uh, definitely. <clears throat> Thank you, warrior, for giving this old relic one last chance to prove its worth. Good luck on your journey. And we get the token. So we got three tokens now. And we go on a sea Sail page. away and see what you will find. So it should be here. Could be wrong. Summer solstice. So you spent time with the druids after all. You make your way to the sacred stones at midday on the summer solstice. The druids, still clad from head to toe in their long robes, are all standing quietly on the stones waiting for you. One of them speaks. We are ready to begin. You pace the perimeter of the stones while the druids form a circle and begin chanting. Soon their low droning attracts the attention of some rat men. We have two monster cards. Six of plague. Four of plague. So we get 10 rat men with 40 health. This should be interesting. Let's kill these, these ranged guys first if we can. Oh crap, we're down to 19 health. Okay, there we go. Finish it off. Our, uh, our health isn't looking that great, that great though. Down to 19 health. Alright, with Retman Dispatch, you turn back to check on the progress of the Druid Ceremony. They appear oblivious to, to you, absorbed in their chanting, and the ritual continues. 
Bandits. Your skirmish with the Ratman seems to have brought you to the attention of a group of bandits. Um, so we get the Jack of Dust and the Four of Dust. Um, hopefully we survive this. I'm not feeling all that confident anymore. Let's get these. I guess they're all range. We're at 13 health. Um, hopefully we can manage without any further difficulty. Ooh, that was close. That was very close. Okay, it's just me and him now. We got him there. Very nice. Oh boy. I don't know, my drink's empty. Cool, we get three game cards, and we get the token. Five food. That'd, that'd be nice. Five more food. And one food. Okay, so we had 11 food out of that. Um, our health is very low, though. We have the trading post. Trade and negotiation. Without these, life would be boring. You and reach a trading short. post in a distant valley run by a strange old woodsman. I've not much use for gold myself, but I trade you for food supplies. Um, let's pay for random armor. I hope you like it. I traded away my favorite elven cloak to get it. Draw one armor card. Get the depth of the night. That's a new one. Once per encounter, the player chooses to discard randomly drawn monster cards and draw again. Okay, that's cool. Uh, they're both medium, so I'll definitely really? take that. Really? Is that what you're going to do? Here, you have this on the house. The trader hands you an unusual suit of armor, saying, I traded it for a bear skin, but I don't think it was worth it. Put the armor away to be identified later, so we get the token. For that, that's what, five tokens now, I want to say? Twisted Canyon. Um, I like our weapon. Let's leave it. We have another hangman. Jesus Christ. One blessing. Guardian Angel. After your first chance Useful. card pick, you may return the card and draw again after shuffling. So that one's awesome. And blunted Aura. Attacks from ah, players. Weapons that do is less one of damage. My favorites. Crap. I hate that one. Down to 30 max health now. Um, traveling Jeweler. We don't have any gold, so we can pass it by. We're going on the ferry boat. All the world is a game board, and us men and women merely players. Found a shop in a shady grove. I alone do not trail. play. So that's I maintain the rules. You have um, choices. The maiden. And Very I nice. have predestination. Let's ask for supplies. Your choices, though, are merely a rediscovery of that which you already know. So we got 10 food from her. Another hanged man. Jesus, come on. Uh, toxic blood. Any hit I on a player during combat has a chance powerful. to poison the attacker. I will have to rebalance that next time. And last man standing in every combat, the last enemy alive can no longer be stunned or interrupted. Honestly, I'm surprised you're not dead. If you survive such ill fortune, I doubt you will be the first. We're done 20 max health. We found the stairs. Bound Let's get the hell out of here. Seeking the heart of it all. The king waits. Powerful. Silent. Death in steel plate. Remember town hero? Let's ignore him. The... Oh dear. <laughs> oh I boy. Got another curse. To be down to 10 health. To have accumulated 10 curses, or impressed that you've done it and still survived. Go up first. Fire in the deep. The Veterans of the old war spin the tails a large, powerful creature built of rock and flame. Home and Not all of their attacks can be countered by mere mortals. It is a terrifying beast. Um. 
Okay, I guess we have to flee. You easily outrun the creatures, leaving the old man to his fate. It, would, it wouldn't let me choose to accept. I really wish I could go there, but I can't sell anything and I don't have any gold. Um, King of Skulls. This mighty One lord of the undead, the skeleton king's defenses are practically impenetrable, and he'll use both sword and shield to fell you. This oh token boy. will unlock more cards if you can defeat this encounter. Well, here we go. We're down to ten health. We uh got some 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 work ahead of us. something and it killed me. What the hell was that? Anyways, let's um Dead. and with an artifact unused. Perhaps that might have saved you. Let's open these up. Will you play again? Donating food for the orphans, we get Ring of Punishments and Charity 6. Um daring to take the cursed treasure, receive 30 gold. And the occult ring. We're working in the Holy Forge, we get um, an armory, draw three, select one to keep card, and forbidden armor. Twilight Ritual, or for protecting the Druid's Ritual, we receive the card Twilight Ritual. And the final card, for reaching the trading post in the deep forest, we receive ten food. Trader's Ring and Wilderness Armor. Um, so, yeah, we uh, did quite a bit, but we ended up dying there. Um, I'll be back once I get back to the King of Skulls. Your victories may so have I will made see you guys in just a second. Hey guys, we're back. We got the King of Skulls here. Let's see what we can do. Try and eliminate him first. Ooh, that was, that was rough. Holy crap, he does a lot of damage. Did we finish him? Oh, there's another guy. There's one guy left. That's all we gotta do. We just gotta take care of him. Holy crap, are we gonna do it? Oh my god, guys. We finally done it. We finally beat the King of Skulls. That took way too long. Way too long. But we finally accomplished it. So let's see what he has to say. Being well used here. <laughs> The King of Skulls has avoided my grasp until now. You have sent him to my realm. It is time for a long delayed reckoning. So we have unlocked the pinnacle. Um, we get new starting gear. Um, you advance to powerful blows more quickly. So um, our combos, um, it's like a higher multiplier for those. Blessing bonus. At the start of your adventure, you'll be blessed. Skeleton regen. Skeletons will now reanimate. Um, so that's troubling. Ratman warriors, warriors will perform leap attacks. That could be a problem as skeletons have had their health increased. So, not, not only do they have the health increase, but they have the regen. Skeletons will be a problem now. Luckily, we've uh, defeated the King of Skulls finally. Um, before they get those boosts. Take the pentacle, then. It will only benefit you so far, and no further. Okay, so we got a few tokens uh, for 
defeating the player in the deep encounter. Um, yeah, I did that. Um, There's some lava golems. It was pretty interesting. Um, I'm sure we'll get to them more soon. Um, let's check these out. So we get mithril armor, um, assassin's greed, the infernal potion. We unlocked golem hunting party. So yeah, we're gonna be finding those plenty. Um, another golem hunting party and a third. So I'm assuming that's gonna replace ratman hunting. Hopefully replace. Um, if you're a ratman, the better, in my opinion. And as a reward for defending the skeleton king, we got the skeleton king helm. Skeleton King Shield and the Skeleton King Sword, so that's cool. Um, we also unlocked the Queen of Scales and the Cave Rescue. So that is it You've come for today. Than I expected. Um, we finally beat the King of Skulls. We completed the third out of the four sets that we've seen in the story mode. Um, so I guess next time we'll go after the Queen of Scales. That'll be pretty interesting to, to get into. Uh, but like I said, that's it for today. I do hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, uh, please leave a like. If you want to see some more, feel free to subscribe. Um, there's going to be plenty more Magicite, Binding of Isaac, and Hand of Fate, along with uh, Vertical Drop Heroes. Um, that game has been pretty fun. Although, uh, I'm not I'm not too, um, too skilled at that quite yet, but uh, it is still really fun. Uh, but like I said, that's it for today. Hope you guys have a good day, but I am out, so I will see you guys next time.